Recycling Drone by Teak Bostic, Gabriela Cuicas, Ethan Tosh. Here's an overall layout of our project. Here are some of the concepts we had for the gripper of the project. And then here's the second concept. It's a lightweight robotics arm. And then here is the soft uh, robotic manipulator. This is the first design we had. And you can see here is our actual design concept for the drone. And essentially, we just want to put everything inside that box. Now here are some of the design considerations. Um, basically, the bigger the chambers inside the grippers, the less brush you have to use. And then after a while, we were able to make a prototype and actually build it. And then here, once again, is just the process of how we made the silicon gripper. We first 3D printed the layout and to later laid down the silicon. And then here's a picture of our schematic. Our schematic um, works. And just future developments, uh, making everything more lightweight. As of right now, the overall design weighs a pound. And our goal for the rest of this, or for this class, uh, was just to prove that this could be made and design our initial prototype. And then here's just an overall timeline. As you can see, it was mainly just designing and um, building the first prototype of our project. And we were able to complete everything on time. This was the first design. We originally wanted to do an electrical system, but decided against it. And this is the second design. And this is when we started going into the soft robotics. And then here is the third design. This one was a lot thicker than the one before. The one before was flimsier and was not sturdy. Um, but this one was too thick and it was actually uh, difficult to bend. So we had to redesign this again. And then here is the last design we made. See, it's a little bit different than the ones before. It, ha it is thinner and it has more chambers on the inside. So that way it takes less pressure for it to start um, bending. And we can see in the back the straight piece of that part is the part that doesn't, um, that doesn't bend. And if you try to put it back in there, just to see that this was made from that mold. And then here's just the overall prototype. We have the Arduino board, we have air pumps, and a couple of transistors as well. And that is just the voltage regulator flickering on and off. And now the test. So we're controlling it with the RC controller. And if we flip the switch, you see that it starts to bend. 